What's up, everybody? Dog Dog 195. There's levels to this. All right, so this is day seven with the Asus Rogue Ally. Just a small, quick update today on the battery life situation. So we went to the gym, and my youngest son uh, Julian took this with him, and this was the first time that he took it without the actual charger. It lasted the car ride to the gym and about an hour and a half that we were in the gym. And then by the time we got back into the car, it was it had completely died. I think it completely died in the car. So, again, if, if you're getting this with the mentality that this is all you're going to need and it's going to be a portable console, that's uh, a huge misconception. You're going to want to take this with its charger. With at, the, at that point, it's up to you to decide whether or not you feel this is portable enough. Now, to be fair, I um, I carry a laptop book bag mostly everywhere I go. And in my laptop book bag, I have my Surface Pro, which I actually have right here. Okay, so I carry my Surface Pro with me. Um, I carry my Switch OLED. And um, I carry uh, the mouse that comes with it and, and, and my Switch game case. So throwing this in that bag is not going to make the bag like extremely heavy or anything like that so i could throw this in a charger in the bag as well the only thing is i would want to get a case for this which obviously right now there's not many cases out there for it but as far as this being a portable gaming console i don't know how portable you want to consider this and again that's just just me not being honest two hours of battery life and then you know it's dead now if you charge it with the charger that comes with it within i think it's like half an hour you get a pretty decent charge so not too bad uh but again if you're thinking that this is going to be portable for you uh, i don't know and he had it in performance mode and it lasted that long right whereas typically i tell you guys i'm always playing on turbo if i'm playing this i'm playing this because this is a handheld console that can give you a console like experience so that's why i'm gonna play this in turbo mode i'm not sacrificing and not playing this in turbo mode that's that's what we're not gonna do so i just want everybody to be clear on that but that means that for me yeah battery life is is atrocious so after a few gameplay i gotta turn this off oh this is must be a heavily intensive oh this guy's still up Oh, wow, that guy's still up. That guy's still up. Look at him. Oh, no. Uh, what do I want? What do I want? I want my big gun. Where he at? Where he at? Where he at? Where he at? Let me collect all this stuff. Uh, this is Atomic Car, if you're wondering what game this is. Playing off a of Game Pass. Quick update from yesterday's video. Somebody told me, uh, a few people actually told me that, Doc, you're wrong. You can play Game Pass games offline. You just have to um, put Game Pass in offline mode. Oh, oh my Lord Jesus. Heal up, heal up, heal up. There you go. Uh, so I'll be honest with you guys. Mostly when I'm playing this at home, I am also playing this connected. Meaning I'm also playing this uh, plugged into the wall there so it gets its full power. So even, even in that scenario, even though this is supposed to be a handheld... I don't even use it as a handheld at home either. Not, not, not really. So, so who is this for? I guess that's the question. Who, who really is this for? If, if, if we can already agree that we're not gonna really, damn, can I kill this guy? Oh, I got, I got, I gotta get my energy back. Hold on. Oh, oh, I can kill it with the fire. I need to get my energy back. Hold on. Come on. You know what? I'm tripping. Let me kill this thing with the axe as soon as it stop. Bow. There it is. Bow. Okay, I should be able to shoot it now. Did I not kill it? I did kill it. Okay, hold on. Bow. I don't know how well this is going to translate to the screen. Hopefully it looks good too. Can I get that? I can't reach that far. Damn. Mm. 
I'm sorry, I'm over here getting distracted by the game. Anyways, um, yeah, so battery life was the biggest thing for, for today. <sighs> and it's, is it really a portable console? I guess that's the question. Is this really a portable? It's a, it is a handheld console. I would have considered this very portable. I go, I guess, I, I guess it still is portable. It's just whether or not you're okay taking the, it's whether or not you're okay taking the the uh, what you call it with you. That's what it comes down to. If you're okay taking it with you, then you're fine, you know. But if you're not okay taking it with you, then yeah, that's a problem. I, I I never understand this 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 lock thing in this game. I feel like I'm always guessing. Yeah, this, this thing makes no sense to me. If, if anybody knows how to figure this stuff out. Oh, there it is. As soon as I said it. Um, That's a good guy, right? Get to the third floor. Yeah, I don't, I don't think... One of those robots doesn't really attack people. No matter how mad he is. Let me get in here. Oh, this is going to drive y'all crazy. So I'm not gonna stay here for this, but um, yeah. So not a lot to report today. Just I'm still liking it. What is it gonna make the 14 days? We shall see. Come on. Ooh, look at that. Oh, this is gonna take me forever. Oh yeah, this is gonna take me forever. Okay, so I need. Nope. I need yellow and. And red to swap. All right. Uh huh. I need them up here, huh? So while I figure this puzzle, I'm not gonna hurt y'all with this. But um, but yeah. Let me know again if you guys have any questions on this thing. This is day seven for me with the rogue ally. And if y'all are enjoying this, then let me know. You know. And if you guys have any questions, like I said, just let me know. We'll go from there. I'll tell you what, though. After using this for seven days, I've already gotten a lot better with the UI. There's a lot of other little prompt commands that I that I know that I feel comfortable with, you know. So just like anything, after a while, you get used to it. You know the ins and outs of it, and you become more comfortable with it. So it's all good. Doc Dog 185 is over to this. We out. Peace.